What's good, man? Yo, they crazy, bro. That shit crazy, bro. What's up? How y'all doing? I just want to come on here real quick, holler at the game, the mob. Holler at the mob real quick. Down you know I mean? there. Yo, what up, Cole? What's good, bro? What you eating? Yeah. Yo, holla at the mob real quick. I know y'all seen the situation or whatever. I just, I was speeding. I just did a quick little skirt, skirt, and it was in the cut. You know what I mean? It was in the cut, man. You know how they be on the side. They be in the, they be in them cuts, man. I wasn't, I wasn't doing nothing too crazy. It was three in the morning. We was leaving the club. And um, I was I was I was cruising at first, but then I had to, I was trying to go around this car, so I did a quick little yeah, spin off real quick, and they happened to be in a cut and caught me. It just sounds so bad though when they say reckless driving, like it's like they make it seem like I was out here <laughs> speed racing. <laughs> it made it seem like I was speed racing, man. But nah, you know, quick little skirt skirt at the vetti. You know, skirt skirting in the vetti and, you know, police was in the cadet. And they caught me. Nothing too dramatic. I ain't gonna lie. It kind of, it kind of got, I ain't gonna lie. It kind of got blown out of proportion. It was a little more dramatic than it was. But, you know, that's how it go sometimes. It ain't nothing too crazy. I just wanted to talk to the mob about it because I know y'all see it. And I know y'all wondering. I see y'all in the comments talking about is you free, is you good, you good. Yeah, it was, it was something like I ain't gonna lie, I didn't know they was gonna rush me though. I, I could have sworn, you know, when you speed, you get a ticket. But, you know, maybe it's different out here. So, it is what it is. I know I done, I done got speeding tickets plenty of times on the Humble. But I guess they just wasn't with the shits. I guess it's just, you know, this is just different vibes out here, different, different rules and regulations. So, you know, it is what it is. And they got my middle name wrong. That's not my middle name. <laughs> my middle name is Casanova. Google it. Casanova with a K. I don't know why they put that middle name. <laughs> oh, that shit pretty, bro. That was the color this whole time? Oh, this is nice. You be getting it like this? This is nice, my mom. It's just mad loud, though. <laughs> like, it's, like, hot. Like, you you see this. And it's outside. But this is sexy, though. I ain't never seen no... This, and this is a good color to get Tiffany blue. That's a good color. It's not the work truck. Yeah. But now nah, I'm Gucci. I'm Gucci. You feel me? It wasn't, you know, nobody was harmed in the situation. You know what I mean? I wasn't, I ain't have no DUI, no crazy, you know what I mean, situation. They tried to pull the whole, I had, I smell like weed in the car. Like, I don't even smoke weed. I definitely don't smoke in my cars. The most I smoke, y'all always see me with a puff, with a puff bar. Y'all know, y'all don't, y'all never see me smoking weed. Like, so they tried to pull that probable cause on me to search my car, search my vehicle, whatever the case. I, you know, you know, this is regular. I've been dealing with this. Since I was like before, I was even famous. Like this, this is regular in New York. They pull you over for the, the stupidest things and say, "Oh, such and such," and they try to use any type of probable cause, like weed. They always use that weed shit to search a car. It was a little dramatic, but I mean, yo, man, y'all know how this shit go. I'm good though. Gucci, I just ready to get the fuck up out of there. You know, nobody likes to sit in no fucking cell for twelve hours and shit like that. That's annoying. Huh? Yeah, they had me in a little single double shit. They was they, they when I came in, they asked me. They was like, um, do you want to go 
And then what they seen, like, all of the girls was like, oh, that's young and man, that's young and man. Because I told them I came in there straight up. I was like, I don't care. Like, you know, I rock with, I, that's some company for me. You know, being by yourself is kind of worse than being in there with other people. Yeah, so, like, I was like, I'll go in there with them. Like, you know, they show, you know, I ain't nothing for that. You know, nigga get stupid and get smacked. <laughs> nothing changed. But I'm saying, like, oh, they was love and it was love from, you know, the other other people in there, whatever the case so. I respect that. But um yeah, it was something light, man. They they put me in a single joint right across from the main from the main shit. Or whatever. But I kinda rather to be in there with other people because when you in that shit by yourself, you just be in there like feeling dumb. That shit crazy. Yeah, like you just dumb. I'm like, miss, I'm not using a <laughs> I'm not I'm not using the bathroom in here. Let me come out and use the bathroom. Like y'all bugging. They, like the toilet literally right there where you can you can look dead in the shit and see me using the bathroom. I'm like, y'all crazy, bro. Like, I ain't definitely ain't using the bathroom, man. Yeah, uh, but that is what it is. You know what's crazy, though, y'all? Is that I had this, intu- this intuition on me the whole day about police for some reason. I I, like, three scenarios happened yesterday with police. And, like, from the time I woke up yesterday morning... I just felt it like in my spirit, like something with police wasn't going to go right today. I don't know what it was. I don't know if it's just my guardian angels or whatever the case. But like I woke up yesterday morning just like getting a bad energy about police. And I tried to ignore it because I'm like, maybe, I don't know, maybe I'm just, I don't know, maybe I'm just thinking just negative or whatever the case. So I tried to like ignore it. And sure enough, man, I should have went with my intuition. No cap. I should have just went with my intuition. I had a feeling. And y'all know I don't be getting in trouble, man. I ain't no problematic person. I don't be, you know what I mean, doing doing nothing or shit like that, you know. But unfortunately, you know, sometimes it's the wrong place at the wrong time. And that's what happened. That's all. But you know, I had to come in here and holler at the mob, you know. Speak speak, speak up on it because, you know, a lot of people are hearing from me. You know, you got brands. You got people that kind of, like, look up to you, kids and shit like that. And I don't want them seeing that and thinking that shit is cool. Like, I'm out here just... Joy riding and doing a bunch of crazy shit. But that's not even the case, you know. Facts. Trust those feelings, man. Trust those feelings. That's a fact. I'm a cool person. I don't even go out like that. I barely go out. When I go out, I'm going out because I just, I just probably need to go out. Just to get my mind on things or whatever the case. And I just happen to be in that situation. But it's, it's, it is what it is, man. I know now to trust my intuition. I always do, but for some reason, this particular day, I just was like, you know, I ain't going to let it hold me back. But, you know, sometimes you just got to go with your gut feeling. But y'all, though, we ain't going to keep talking negative. I just wanted to kind of clear the air on that. You know what I mean? I see these all over the blogs. I ain't gonna lie, I didn't expect it to get I didn't expect it to get out so soon. Like I literally just got out of the precinct and like not even an hour later it hit the blogs so fast, like that's how you know they all cooperate together. But I guess I'm not. Nah, this not the mango one. <laughs> Them, this not the mango one. Yo, Cuzzo, you see I got the dreadies? I don't want to call them dreads, though, bro. You're not supposed to call them dreads, bro. You got to call them locks, bro. This not the mango one. This is called uh, banana papaya, I think. Yeah. Banana papaya. It's actually good. 